Hey, Sean, good to see you. Good to see you. Long, and we saw you last at the Western Guilford game. I think it was a JV game when I saw you. I got to meet you. Yes, then. sir, probably. Yeah. How are you doing these days? I'm doing great. Yes, sir. Well, got yes, a big, sir. You must be. You got a big smile on your face. That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah. If we had to take you back to Western Guilford, just out of curiosity, I thought I got to ask you this question. Uh -huh. If you had to go back to the old school now, sit right back in the offense, would it fit and just go right back out the same way? Could, could you do that again? I think I could, but. Uh, you adjust well. Yeah, yeah, I would, yeah. What's it been like taking over this team the past year and a half? Oh, I loved it. I mean, just coming to the school, I mean, it's just been awesome. It's a great experience, um, great people there. And the, the football team is just such such a family. Like you can't you can't break it away. There's nothing like it. I love what do you like it. most about being over there? Uh, definitely the Christian aspect of it. You can't get that in public school. I mean, this is uh, just I'm asking questions now, not on this. Uh, okay. List. Right. Did you have that same Christian uh, feeling before you went over there? Is it something you built upon or picked up since you went it's, there? It's, I I mean I definitely was a Christian, but had it going in. It was. It has definitely picked up since. You've then. nurtured it since yes, you got sir. there. Yes, sir. It's a good environment for you. Over there, it dude. is. I love it. Yeah. Now, do you drive over there yourself? Yes, sir. There? I do drive. That's not a big factor then. No problem. No, no. I mean, about 25 minute drive. I mean, not bad. But. If you win a state championship, you would probably drive to uh, Timbuktu or this far reaches somewhere. You probably oh, drive. Yeah. Over. Yes, I'm not getting a title means a lot. That's a big thing for you trying to get yes, the sir. championship. Uh, what are you expecting to see in that game against your opponent, Raven Gap, tomorrow night? Um, I'm definitely from our defensive standpoint. I'm definitely. About to see a lot of passing, a lot of passing. But uh, for their defense, um, they play a lot of, a lot of cover four, cover eight, man. I mean, they they don't they don't blitz a lot, put it like that. They 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 don't let te teams throw. Them. So they don't so, come out to you too hard. They're gonna kind of sit back and let you right. throw the ball and then go after it, try to steal right. it. Exactly, exactly. Who's your favorite receiver? Name, name some of your receivers that. Some who's your, who's your primary target and some of your primary targets? Um, Dre Davis, Tyron Melton, Brett Bell. Is, is it you guys? Your quarterback's good, kind of a hot guy who's hot at that time. You kind of hit Actually, him. yes. He's yes, been sir. hot lately. I know Davis was uh, hot yeah, early. Yeah, Dre, Dre Davis, was, he was hot uh, last game. A couple game games before that when we played South Lake, it was Tyron Melton. Tyron How about Melton just Tyron Melton? Touchdowns. I remember Tyron from Page. And yes, Tyron sir, was, yeah. always said was a basketball kid, the yeah. two guard. I remember Tyron in that game last year over in Winston and that's a regional championship game. Mm -hmm. Man, when Page got beat that, that was a tough loss yeah. for everybody involved. But how was he yeah. come on as a, a football player from basketball? Well, he, he played in middle school. I just, yeah, he just didn't, I don't think he really wanted to play in high Gave school. Gave it up for a couple years. Because, right, yeah, just because of the how, how well he's doing in basketball. So. Here's the ten million dollar question. <laughs> so I gotta ask you this. Yes, this is coming out of the top of Andy's head here. Uh -huh. Are you and Tyron? You, you gotta take care of all your football business. Right, yes, football's sir. over. Yes, sir. Both you guys gonna slip him that basketball team too? Yes, sir. That's the plan. How many uniforms do they got over there? Man, they got so much. Got it's amazing. Uniforms. <laughs> they must have a million. They must, yeah. the, the numbers must go to 100, 101 because they're like God, crazy. The basketball there has just gone off the charts. It's gone. Yeah, wild. yeah. Well, actually, I mean, right now they're they're about twelve people on the team, eleven or twelve people on the team, including, uh, including me and Tyron. Including so. you two. Yes, sir. That's so. a tight roster, 12. Yeah. Man, yeah that's 12 guys that can play. Can play. Yes, sir. That's 12 guys that can play. Like you got 14 guys. Right, right. I saw you UNCG last year. You did recently joined the team. You yes, guys sir. had the Martin Luther King Day game yep, at yep, UNCG. Yes, so you were yes, there. Sir. Seemed like you enjoyed being on that basketball yeah, team. Yeah, I love it. Yeah. It's awesome. The football, I mean, I'm going to say this again. This is me. No sheet, no nothing. This is, football's still your favorite sport, I guarantee it, right? Yes, sir. It's and, up there. Yeah. Yeah, it has to be because, I mean, you've been a football man for and You always put up good numbers and you, you fought through the adversity. Yes, sir. You, you, yes, you've sir. landed yep. well here at Point Christian. Uh, what, is, to, what would it mean to win a state title for your state championship? Well, I mean, <laughs> question of the night. I mean, I can't really describe. I mean, like you said, I've, I've been through so much adversity. I just, I mean, it, it would mean so much. I mean, <laughs> You take you take it with you for a long time, yes, man. Long you don't. Time. I mean, it's one of those, you, you're a humble kid too, because yes, you got the big smile. You handle things well. It's not the kind of you win a title. You don't take it back to the old neighbor and say, "Hey guys, no, look at this." No, you you let it roll. Let it roll. Let it roll. Yes, you still keep up with some of the old buddies? Old Actually, friends? do. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yes, sir. I do. Uh, one of uh, my old center, Andy Dixon. Big man, yeah, number seventy. Yeah, yes, sir. Because you swear my old number. I yes, sir. Back in anyway, Andy Dixon, big yeah, man. Yeah, one, yeah. one of my best friends for a long time. Too, didn't he? Yeah, he did. I haven't talked to him in maybe. That's got to be your best friend. Your best always your old center. Exactly. Yes, sir. Uh, yeah. Anybody else much? Um, not too much. How about Sibley? Did you know Michael Sibley? Michael Sibley, yeah. yeah he yeah, was here a couple yeah. weeks ago. Yeah. Okay, yeah, good yeah, man, yeah. good man. I haven't, I haven't talked to him in a while either. Yeah. But you got Davis, you mm -hmm. got Melton, and you got uh, Austin Henley, some too. Austin right? Henley, yeah. You ever dump it he off? Comes, to, he comes out of the backfield. You ever yes, dump it off 240 pound fullback and just oh, let yeah. him go? Oh yeah, yeah. 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 He, he comes out of the backfield. I give him to him. It's good stuff. Yeah. Good. What do you think about the competition level here? Competition level, yeah. That's that's one thing that most people look down upon. They ask but, a lot of questions. Yeah, about it, yeah. But, I mean, 
the competition is going to be the same anywhere you go. I mean, there's going to be teams who are not as good as you, and there's going to be teams who are good or if not better than you. And you might just say this, we take care of the competition along the way to get to the best competition at the end. Exactly. There's got to be some good competition. Exactly. And, and one team is going to end up being better than another team. What so, do you keep doing to get better during the all season and during the season? What do you keep doing to get better? Well, for me, I know that while defense is going, I just got to keep practicing throwing and my footwork. Cam and, Newton does. I mean, I have to know something about Cam. I will talk to Mr. Sarah from the News of Record mm -hmm. for her. What do you remember from games? This is what I remember about Cam. Always, and he's not in the game. And you don't see this in all quarterbacks. That dude's all, and before he goes, forgets, he's always throwing that ball. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I try to do most of the time in the, mm -hmm. in the games, too, while our defense is on the field and punt and kick and all Who that stuff. Who are you throwing with? Um, you pick out a certain guy Sometimes, the Sometimes it's just the, the younger guys that's on the field or that's not on the field. They're catching up yes, for you? Yes, yeah, sir. Yeah, sir. Yeah. yeah. With about a 27, 28-man roster, your guys are all active, right, pretty much? Exactly, yes, sir. And, and that's the good thing about our team. We, from I know Coach Bell can attest to this, we don't have one person on the team that we're afraid to put out on the field. Mm -hmm. And that's that's such a good thing because Makes I it mean, a true some, team. somebody goes down, I mean, you can call anybody who plays that position. If they called on you field. like the, uh, Paige did years ago and James Summers came in the game late in the season for the Pirates uh -huh. who won the title, if they called on you to play defense, where do you go and what do you do? Um, most likely we will move our starting safety to corner mm -hmm. and just put me at safety. Midfield? Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. yeah. Go to the ball and uh, drop back quick on right. defense. Yes, sir. Yeah. Have you played any defense this year? <laughs> no, not at all. Fortunately, right? Um, for, yeah, yeah, if you can just focus yeah. on quarterback, that's the better thing. Exactly. I was thinking about this, I always remember these things I carry with me to this show. I think I thought about a lot yesterday was the fact if you're playing offense, and running the ball, and maybe even throwing the ball, mm -hmm. you have to kind of tra – it's tough. People say, oh, I just love play. I want to go to the field. It's still got to be a little tough to transition to, I know i got to tackle the guy. Right, yeah. I've been running the ball, and I've got to tackle this guy now. That's, that's got to be a tough change. Right, and in, in my career as a football player, I haven't really had to play defense that much. I mean, in middle school a little bit, but uh, – but. In high school, I haven't really had to play defense, so I can't imagine how that is for a person who has to play both ways. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I can only imagine it's hard. Just trying to imagine a running back yesterday, thinking about this. He's running the ball, he's, going, he's tearing people, he's bowling people over. He's got to mm -hmm. turn right around and start to catch those same guys right, and bring right. those guys yeah. down. Have you thought about this much? I mean, the championship game, most important. Raven Gap, your next opponent, mm -hmm. most important. But uh, thought about the college future, where you might do what you might do in college? Um, where you might go? Well, I am a reclass junior, so right. I don't, as of right now, there, I'm looking at some schools. I mean, I'm, I'll, I'll be visiting Campbell this weekend for a recruiting visit. Campbell, Campbell's um, going with uh, Mike Minner, right? right? Yes, sir, Mike Minner. Tough man. He yes, needs sir. some help. Got a lot of local guys. He got the kid, uh, Deshaun Jones from Grimson, running the ball yeah. good for them. Yeah. They got uh, also got to Allen Hart out of Northern Defense. And, yes, sir, yeah. And, also and got, actually, one of Dalton our. Dalton Dillon, the old running back over there, too, out of Northwest. Right. Yeah, yeah. 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 And one of our tight ends, long before me, mm -hmm. is actually playing there, too. So. That's, that's a good thing for me. But um, Campbell's one of the teams. Yeah. Campbell's. Um, I've been. To, I mean, I've been to a lot of recruiting visits. Uh, Coastal Carolina. Um, Who's your favorite uh, college team? Any of all. Of, this is your favorite. You play for them in a heartbeat if you could. Well, that's why. I mean, okay. Clemson. Clemson Tigers. Clemson, yes, yeah. Boy, tell you, is it Mr. Watson Good. down there now? Yeah, Deshaun Watson. Does yes, a good sir. job. And yeah. uh, DJ Reader is still there. Saw so yeah. DJ on TV last week. Yeah. Number 48. Big guy to Grimsley. Yeah, I just, I just love the coach. Yeah. yeah. I love him. Coach He's Sweeney. Awesome. Coach, coach Sweeney, Sweeney as well. Yeah. Tell you what, the guy's got a lot of energy, but he's still got his uh, stuff together. Right, yeah. No doubt about it. Favorite protein? Favorite protein, New England Patriots, all the way. I come on, is it because of Tom Brady? It's because of Tom Brady. <laughs> love his work, love his Tom work. Brady and Bill Bell, yeah. Tell me what Coach Bell means to you and means to this team. Uh, Coach Bell, I mean, he's such a great mentor to me. Uh, last year, all right, so at school we had to do a mentoring program. Last year he was my mentor for that half a year that I came. And, I mean, he just he, he teaches so much. Not not necessarily football, but life after football, how, how to grow as a man. And, I mean, he's just, such, like I said, such a great mentor, and he loves the kids. I mean, he, he, loves his, he loves his players all the way. Here's my academic dog coming. I mean, I'm academic <laughs> dog. You read class as a junior, yes, sir. and you've, done, you've got a 4.6 GPA. Yes, yeah. How do you find enough classes to keep you busy the next two years? Well, how does that uh, work? Probably take some online classes next year. That's a good idea. Yes, sir. Do you take those while you're at the school? You stay at home and take those. How does that work? Well, I'm not quite sure yet. Yeah. I'll find out. It'd be kind of funny if you stay home and take them uh, until about midday and come to school for right. practice right. like yeah. half the day. But yeah. Some people that sounds good to me. Yeah. 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 I'll tell you what, you've done a great job. I'm just glad to talk to you again. All good right, to see you. Tell you. your good dad we said hello. Keep up the good work. I'm going to put your stats on the website every week. Yes,